newly sworn in Lungu has already begun naming his cabinet. Inonge Wina, a woman's rights activist and the former gender minister, has been appointed as Zambia's first female vice president. Among other key appointments was Harry Kalaba, who has been retained as foreign affairs minister. The reappointment, meanwhile, of Alexander Chikwanda, a close political ally of Lungu as finance minister, was widely expected. It signals the continuity of economic policies introduced under former President Sata's rule. However, with another election due late next year when Sata's term would have ended, Lungu's cabinet will have little time to turn around a struggling economy. The southern African country has averaged 6 to 7 percent growth as the mining sector boomed, but growth slowed to 5.5 percent last year. The IMF says and could ease further with the price of copper at a six-year low this month. Maria Galang, CCTV.